guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to make an intro. So, I'm going to be using KindMaster for this. It's another free app you can get. It's the KindMaster one right there. But, first you need to pick a background color for, for the um, video. Like, I have already chosen mine. So here is my video edit pics. Um, here is my intro, actually. So to put those pictures, you have to take a screenshot of your horse or whatever you want to put on there. And you have to cut it out using PixArt. And then, for example, like this. You put, you cut out the hand and then you stick it on a green background, which is this right here. You can screenshot that if you would like, if that would help you. And you can screenshot that, I don't care. And the hand, it took me forever to find a good hand. <laughs> um, so yeah, it took me forever to find a nice, nice enough hand. And you just stick it on a, back, a green background and then you can use that in in the um, intro. So I'm going to, I'm not gonna be making a new intro, I'm just gonna be showing you how to make one. So I'm gonna use the same background right here. So what you do is you go to Kind Master. There's all kinds of ways you can make intros but I like to use Kind Master because it's just easier. So you click on that, that. Okay. Then you click on media. And video edit pics. Then you click on the picture you want to use. Chat mark. And I just like to make it just long enough for me to work with. Then, hang on, is my recorder on? Okay, yeah. I changed my recorder's color to sea foam green because I got tired of it being orange. And then, <laughs> it's been so long since I've made an intro. Well, not so long, but I'm kind of forgetting how. What you do is like you, you make it however you want. Like you can put text on there. Like, say, hello, welcome to my channel. Then you can, like, choose a font for that. And make it however big you want. And you can choose the color if you'd like. Then, instead of just having it sit there all still and boring, you can put in animation, which would make it like how it's gonna come onto your screen. Which I like the slide ones. I'm gonna do slide down. Then overall is like how it acts the whole time. You can do like floating, drifting, squishing. A little bit some more. And then out animation is how it goes out of the screen. So I'm gonna slide up. So then you click play and see how you like it. Hold on, a little longer than that. Okay, too long. It does take a little time to make an intro. Okay. Then do another layer of text.
know, I got really quiet there for a minute. Just focusing. Oops. Okay, so after you have all your text that you want on there, then you can start adding pictures and stuff. I don't have any pictures ready. I should have done that, but then for here, he's squeaky. Hey little kitty. Then you go back to media. Video edit pics. Put your subscribe button. Then this is where you get your little hand in here. I don't know how long to put it yet. But then you go to Chrome key. And you click enable. And then it takes the green away. So now you have just a hand. Then in animation, I'm going to do sorry, pop up. No, I don't like that. That's fine. All right. Let me try some of them. Let's see. Nah. Okay. Then you just see if you like it. Alright, when it goes up, then you can put Right here, it's hard to get everything timed correctly. It's hard sometimes. Okay, I want that to end at the same time as the hand goes away. Good enough. Oh, and I want it to fade away. And I want it to fade. Alright, now let's see. Alright, that's good enough. Then I'm just gonna slide that down like that. Then watch it. Okay, that's good enough. But one thing I didn't do was put pictures, so I will be right back to Kind Master. I'm gonna show you something real quick. If you go to PixArt, what Squeaky? Since when do you want to rub on me like that? You never want to do that. Don't knock my tea over. <laughs> 
Okay. I'm gonna go to my video edit pics and find that that green background. Then you go to sticker. Hey, hey! Okay, you knocked my tea over. Stop. <laughs> go to your cutout stickers. I've got plenty of pictures of my horses. And... Okay, I'm gonna... Since I have this horse, I'm gonna use it. You just make it as big as you can fit on this green thing. Like that. Oh, hang on. Down. That's pretty good. Save. And this was before the clothes glitch got fixed. <laughs> Luckily, I have a lot of clothes, but not the pretty ones like I like. But I'm saving up my pearls since I have all the pets I want. Okay, so after you do that, you go back to your video and edit again. And then now, here's where you do this. And I'm going to do that one. From the key on. Oops. Okay, someone's yelling, I don't know who that is, but Okay, where am I gonna put this horse? I need to put you somewhere. I guess that's good enough. <laughs> that's that's funny. Okay. You put it right there and see. Just see what it does. Okay, that I'm gonna leave like that. That's funny. Okay. I have one more picture. Sorry this is taking so long. It just it takes a while to get everything perfect. Well, nothing's perfect, especially not when it comes to things that I make, but anyway. I try. Okay, that was too soon. Right. Okay, now I want this to do something.
Alright, let's try that. Okay, I guess that's good enough. So now that I'm done with my intro, I'm gonna click on it and hit the share button. Then you're gonna click export. Sorry, a loud truck just drove by on outside. Then you have to wait for that to get done exporting. And for some reason, adding music on KineMaster is not working for me. I've tried so many times and I've even looked it up and no one has having that problem. It's like you put the music, you can hear it playing, but then once you save it, it's like the music's not there. It's like just not there. And I have my media all the way up. I have all my volumes all the way up and it's not there. So I, don't know, I have no idea why. So... So what I have to do is use Duo Recorder, which is my recording app slash editor. So I use that to put music because they have a lot of free choices on there. What, Squeaky? This cat never wants to like rub on me like this. She's not like a sweet cat that just wants to love on you, but she's loving on me right now. I don't know if you can hear her, but she's kind of squeaky sounding. She goes, me. Instead of meow, she goes me. Okay, it's done its porting. And now I'm gonna go. I don't know if my recorder is going to work if I go on the recording app itself, so I'm gonna try this. Okay, it's still working. So, you go to edit video and you click on that video that you just did. And, is that it? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Add music. Alright, so here is the free music that comes on it. But, I like to do online music because there is a hundred choices. Like, tons of choices of music you can do. But I really love this one. Modern. It's the one that is on my, what do you call it, intro right now. But sadly, I have Android phones, so you can't hear the music, so I'm just going to add it. Of course, you already know what it sounds like if you're watching this video. I turned down the audio because I don't know if it, if it heard me or not, but I don't like my talking in my intro. <laughs> so there, I'm going to turn up my volume just to see if I can hear it. I'll, you know, I'll turn it all the way up just to see if you can hear it. Okay, that's loud! Okay, I'm sure you heard that, because that was loud. I didn't know my volume went that loud. <laughs> wow, okay. So, that is perfect. I'm going to hit save. And one more thing, I just really want to thank you guys, because I'm almost at 4,000 subscribers. I did not expect my channel to get that high. When I reached 1,000, I was like, no way, this can't be. I, I have no idea how or why I got that many, but apparently I did, <laughs> and it's really cool. So thank you, thank you everybody for that. And then, the intro is in my gallery. So now, on video edit, which is Duo Recorder's folder, there's the video. And I delete the old one. And I delete the pictures. And boom! Made an intro. I just did the video on how to make a thumbnail, so. Yep. Uh, and actually, there's that video right there. 
that's the intro, I mean the thumbnail video. So I'm about to go post these and edit. So I hope this video helped you on how to um, make an intro. There's a lot more videos that could help you with this if I didn't explain good enough. Because I am not good at explaining things. I've probably already told you that, but I am so not good at explaining. And I'm not good at talking, so... <laughs> um, that's basically it. I mean, you can do anything to your intro. You can even make an outro if you wanted to. Like, for the end of your videos, which I prefer to do that. It's, it sounds more cooler, but... I haven't made one yet, and I plan on making one soon. So, if you have any ideas that you would like me to add to my next intro or outro or next video that I should do or something, just please tell me and I can try my best to do that. A lot of you guys were asking me to do an intro and a thumbnail video, and I finally got around to it because I've been very busy, but finally did it, and I hope you liked it. hope it was what you were wanting to see. And again, just thank you for all the subscribers and all the likes. And, yep, have a good day everyone, stay safe, and just enjoy the nice day. Have a good day, bye!